Hello everyone, we are from True Maths and in this video we are going to solve question number 11th of exercise 6.3. The question says, it is given that E is a point on side CB, produce of an isosceles triangle ABC with AB is equals to AC. And if AD is perpendicular to BC and EF is perpendicular on AC, then you have to prove that triangle ABC is similar to triangle C E F. Now, this is given to you that triangle A B C is isosceles, means where uh, this side A C is given equal to this side, this A C is given to equal to A B. And if these two sides are equal, obviously the side opposite to these. The angle opposite to this side must also be equal. So the angle opposite to this side is this, and the angle opposite to this side is this. So angle A, so angle C must also be equal to angle B. So this is the first thing we must know. And if you want to prove that triangle ABD is similar to triangle ECF, the only thing you need to do is you need to prove that two angles of this triangle are equal to two angles of this triangle and if you are able to do that these two triangles will be proven similar and how to do that okay this will be a, a bit confusing here if i make triangle this a this is a this is d and this is b where this ad is perpendicular means this must form a 90 degree and if I make triangle this ECF, this must look like this. Where this is C, this is F and this is E. And this must be of 90 degree, which is given to you. You need to prove that two angles of this are equal to two angles of this triangle. And if you are able to do that, I have already explained that these two will become similar. And in triangle first of all ABC AB is given equals to AC and if these two are equal then we can confirm that angle B must be equal to angle C if these two lines are equal so angle this must be equal to this because angle opposite to equal sides are also equal so angles opposite to equal sides are also equal here so this is the first case now if i talk about in triangle a b d and in triangle e f c this is a b d and this is e m e f c this angle must be equal to this angle because both are of 90 degree. So I can say that angle ADB must be equal to angle EFC. Both are right angles and right angles means both are of 90 degree. And angle B is equal to angle C. So angle B which is this one, angle this is equal to angle C, this one. This angle and this angle are equal. So we can say that this angle of this triangle, this one is equal to this angle. If I see in this triangle, this angle are equal. So angle C is given equal to angle B. So angle C must be equal to angle B. This we have proved. So in these two triangles, two angles are equal and if two angles are equal, then we can confirm that triangle ABD must be similar to triangle EFC. This can be concluded by angle-angle property of similarity. So this is how you can solve this particular question. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel and if you have any problem regarding maths, you can directly contact to us. The phone number, the email address and the WhatsApp number is given below in the description. Thank you.